in this video i'm going to show you how you can set up an on click video pop up uh, when you click on an icon or a button so let me get started so firstly i'm going to show you how you can set up an on click video pop up when you click on an icon so firstly let me go over here and search for the element icon and uh, let me just grab the icon element so when i click on the icon so when i'll click on the icon i'll get a, a nice video pop up so to do that let me just change the let me just make some customizations let me change the color to white and let me just change the icon uh, to a play button to a play icon okay so i like this one so let me choose this one and let me just make this bigger i think this would look nice okay so uh, this is the icon over here so when i click on the icon a video uh, the video pop up will appear so for now let me just save it as draft okay so for the video so for the video let me just uh, copy this uh, youtube video url from over here and the icon i have uh, clicked on and i have the options available over here and when i go to the content over here uh, under the link you need to click over here for dynamic tags click over here and then you need to scroll down and under actions you'll find the option called lightbox and then click on the setting option and under setting you get two option like uh, for the video and for the image so i'm going to choose the video option as i want to make a video pop up so let me just paste the video url which i just copied from over there so let me just uh, save it as draft okay so now let me just uh, preview this video preview this page okay this is the page when i click on this uh, you see uh, there is a nice looking video pop up and when you click on this uh, the video will start playing uh, and okay so this is how it works the on click video pop up and uh, but the two options uh, which are missing that which options are missing that you don't get much options uh, over here like you don't get the autoplay options so you don't get the autoplay options that the problem so for the button so the button you you'll need to follow the exact same method you get the dynamic text option over here so you can follow the exact same option uh, but the uh, button pop up i'm going to make it uh, in a different way uh, set it up in a different way so the video auto plays so uh, so for the button so for the button i have created a separate pop up so under templates when you go to the back end uh, of uh, of your wordpress website and under templates you get the option called pop up so when you click on the pop up you can create a new pop up so i have created a custom pop up called travel pop up and let me just uh, show you how it looks okay so it's loading so uh, this is how the pop up looks uh, which i have custom made and here is the video and i click on the video i get the video options and you can see that uh, i have turned on the autoplay i have turned on the autoplay option over here and i was able to add uh, a bit more details you can see over here i was able to add details from over here so what i need to do now what i'm going to do now is uh, connect this travel pop up with the button pop up so i'm going to just uh, sorry with the button and i click on the button and um, in the link click on dynamic text under actions you will find pop up and click on this settings and uh, and uh, search for the pop up called travel travel pop up okay okay fine 
so now let me just save it as draft again okay done so let me just uh, review this video again okay so when I click on this uh, button over here see the pop-up appears and uh, the video also starts auto playing and you get a nice looking pop-up with the autoplay video and uh, also you can add details underneath the video or customize it however you want to so this is these are the two ways uh, like I've showed you how to set up on click video pop-ups uh, in one of them is you just simply just insert the link of the video and the video will appear like this but you won't get the autoplay option and other options to customize it and another way is by creating a pop-up over here in the back end and the connecting the pop-up with the uh, with to the button and then you get the autoplay options over here and uh, ability to add more details so so I hope this uh, video helped you out and uh, so if this video helped you out then please make sure to like the video and also subscribe to my channel and you can also visit my website called tasvirwebsolutions.com tasvirwebsolutions.com and on this website you will find uh, lots of helpful uh, tutorials regarding uh, uh, Elementor and Thrive Architect and you will also be able to see this with uh, the services I provide and get to contact me so thank you for watching this video have a great day